Hey guys, it's Trim and welcome back to my channel, Runkut TV. This video is not gonna be about BTS. Instead, today's video is gonna be about my personal life and in today's video, we are gonna talk. So, I am gonna tell you guys my life updates and also what I have been up to and why I was not uploading any videos like I did but with huge gaps and all of that stuff and you guys some of you guys know that there is something going on and then like you are right yes there is something going on and I am super excited to tell you what it is so let's quickly hop onto the video and start our conversation so first thing first the reason why I was not uploading any videos is because I had the clips shot uh, like I had the clips but I wasn't editing them it's basically because I am lazy I don't have any excuse for that yeah I want to tell you guys the truth I am so lazy and I struggle with procrastination so much I cannot help it and that's why things go on a pause for such a long time I don't like it but I am just like this from now on I'm promising that from now on I won't be lazy and I will try to upload as many videos as I can because you guys show me so much of love like I just spent for about a month I guess I just spent off from my youtube channel for about a month and you guys like literally sent me DMs and comments about my videos and how much you enjoy watching my videos and how much you love me thank you so much guys thank you so much i love you guys so so much and thank you so much the reason why uh, i wasn't uploading any videos is also but for a month i was in delhi which you guys some of you guys know so whoever follows me on instagram knows that if and i will if you are not following me on instagram then please do because in future if i ever go on a pause like this all the updates will be given on my instagram like you can check if i'm alive or not on instagram because i basically be on instagram 24 7 yeah almost 24 7 i am on instagram so all stories and stuff i'm already always telling what i am doing you can also dm me there if you want to ask something i always reply to all of my subscribers as well so yeah uh, as you guys know i was in delhi for a month and i was not able to shoot any content over there because there was nothing much i could do and the reason why i was there i'm gonna tell you the reason as well so as you guys know i live in jaipur in rajasthan also i don't belong from jaipur i belong from jodhpur which is also another city in rajasthan beautiful 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 city jodhpur i belong from jodhpur the sun city so i got shifted to jaipur last year june july i guess i'm not sure which month it was but june july i got shifted to jaipur and now i'm living here so the reason why i was in delhi was that i am shifting to delhi yeah i know i yeah that's it <laughs> that's it. i don't know if it is such a big thing for you guys or not but for me it is like delhi is such a big city and also there is some other reason why it is very significant not delhi but shifting to a new place is and i'm gonna tell you everything yeah because i really want to talk mm -hmm. so i'm gonna tell you guys everything about my things and all that going on first thing is that yeah i was in delhi right now and that's why i was not able to shoot, uh, shoot new content i was just i just uploaded all the old stuff and i could have uploaded that earlier but as i mentioned i am lazy i didn't and i'm so sorry and i, I won't do that from now on so i have uploaded that and other than that i didn't shot anything like i didn't make any new content over there and as we are shifting so i was there to finalize my new schools my new apartment where we will be living so actually we won't be living in delhi we will be living in noida even better so yeah so i am gonna be shifting to noida by uh, i don't know maybe next week or by this month i will be in noida okay so i just came yesterday to jaipur i just came yesterday to jaipur to literally pack my stuff and leave yeah mm, low-key sad <laughs> yeah i 
am but also like not much but yeah Jaipur is such a beautiful city like if you ever get a chance to visit Jaipur please do it's a beautiful place uh, like it is called the pink city and for me it was a healing city because when I got shifted to Jaipur last year I was fucking depressed very 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 depressed because for leaving my Jodhpur city because all of my stuff I grew up in Jodhpur I lived there for like 13 years and then I got came here and I'm so attached to some stuff in Jodhpur and I had to leave them all behind and come here even though we are like in the same state Jaipur Jodhpur two of them are in the same state still I was so sad so stressed so depressed everything at once so yeah i came here i was very 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 sad and you guys don't not see in my videos because i didn't show that like i tried to be as cheerful as i can in my videos but actually i was not feeling i was not in my best condition but yeah i came here and i was uh, sad but the reason why i call it my healing city is because this city actually healed me literally it showed me a new way of living my life and also taught me that new beginnings are not that bad and you can always start over a new life and maybe sometimes it is even better from the thing that you were living in the past and like i know jodhpur is the best place and maybe the memories i made actually the memories i made over there are my most beautiful moments in life but maybe sometimes i feel like the time i spent over here with my new friends in Jaipur and stuff was like the, uh, a bit better than what I had in Jodhpur. I'm not gonna compare these because both of them are very close to my heart and all that but Jaipur is beautiful seriously I used to hate it literally I used to hate Jaipur so much but now that I am leaving this place I am gonna thank this city like there is something in this city which is completely extraordinary I really like it also that I am now leaving like if you compare the, to the Rim who came to Jaipur and the Rim who is leaving Jaipur like they are two completely different people like if I cannot recognize myself now like she, if I go back to my past self and show her like this is what is the outcome of this like all of this transformation she is not gonna believe her eyes like uh huh I was so in that stuck in my head that I can never get out of this and I can never be happy over here I need to go back I need to go back I need to go back but no I think it is for good and I, whatever happened it happened for good and this transformation made me into this like I was not like this earlier never I was never like this I was completely different like if I compare myself from 12 year old self I am even 13 year old self I am so different now I am completely new like knew me once i also during the time when i was shifting i once saw a reel or a tiktok i am not sure what it was but a video and in that video there was an audio which was saying if you are the person who packs their bags and leaves their hometown to a complete strange new place and start a new life you are the shit and at that time when i saw that i was like i don't want to be the shit no not no thanks i don't want to be the shit i am i am happy like this but now i can proudly say that i am the shit yes i am the shit because i am here to like literally pack my bags go to a complete new city a big city strangers i don't know anybody leave everything behind and start a brand new life i am the shit so ready like i don't think i have ever been so ready for something in my life but right now for this shifting for going to this new place i am so ready to do this like yeah i'm into this i'm gonna take a chance and try this because i just saw like i saw a big example of like a place where i thought i can never be happy i turned out to be happy like so happy i found better friends like yeah these friends were better than what i had in jodhpur so i found friends i found a new version of me which i didn't think ever existed but yeah i found myself and now i think i am ready to take this take my new version and 
evolved even more i am very so that's what this city did to me like i this city like literally taught me a huge lesson in my life so now that i am going to be shifting oh, also like now that i'm going to be shifting don't think that i'm going to do this all alone i'm taking you guys with me with throughout the whole journey i am going to shoot all everything i'm going to shoot all the packing vlogs and shifting vlogs and also move in vlog get decorating my new room i don't know why but you guys are so you really want to see my room but trust me if i just show you my room it's empty like the wall is white i don't i even have a proper bed i just use this like not the wooden frame of the bread uh, bread <laughs> bed my pronunciation so i don't even have like the frame of the bed i just use this my closet is a mess because literally a mess because i have this weird habit of packing at the last minute so when i was going to delhi i literally packed the night before we were about to leave so we were about to leave in the morning and in the night i was doing the packing yeah so what i do is like i take the clothes like yeah this 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 then i select then i throw them in my suitcase and then put the take the whole pile and show it in the cupboard this is what i do yeah and then we just left in the morning and we are up up we were not supposed to come after a month we were supposed to come after a week that was maximum but like we stayed there for a month and now we are back and everything was a mess the whole house was so dirty so everything i just i hate coming to a dirty house and all that but as the house was closed for a month it was also dirty and this morning i just slept yesterday i just slept and today morning i helped my mom to clean the house i did the dishes and all that stuff i made myself a meal after a long time it was tasty so yeah i helped my mom doing all the chores and after that around 4 pm i took a bath yeah i me there is no fixed time to take a bath is there right <laughs> so i take a nice chill cool bath i wash my hair and condition them i wash like it's been like a while since i washed it did it was natural so i washed my hair and today i also felt like oh i don't i try some makeup i so like let's just i was i i was in pretty good mood today so i just took out my makeup and tried it and trust me i it is the best makeup i have ever done since i am born trust me when i say that i do horrible makeup horrible i look annabelle bloody mary whatever you want to say i do horrible makeup but today i look i am looking damn gorgeous <laughs> I am so happy that I'm looking like this. Like trust me, I don't look like this. Oh. And I did this. I do I know that it is not as much as good, but this is my like for the first time I did this much. Even this much is a huge deal for me. And I'm not trying to be like narcissist that I am good. This no 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 no. That's not what I'm trying to be. It's just that I am so happy that I'm looking pretty. I like looking pretty. I like to look pretty actually. So I am looking like this, and my makeup didn't turn out to be a disaster. I am so happy, and I did this makeup. Actually, I saw some YouTube videos in Delhi when I was like feeling bored. So I just I uh, over there I didn't hide my makeup. I don't actually do makeup. I never do makeup. Never, rarely. And when I do, I look that, and then I cry that why do I look like this? Why does my makeup is so? And then I wash my face, and then just leave with some moisturizer on. Back uh, on June 10th, and the proof, the proof album. I 
less money left and it is i don't think right now i should be on something with i should not be in a condition of less money i should save money right now and also if you guys are merch if you guys buy anything never go broke if you know that if you buy this thing and you're going to go broke do not do that it is i am telling you do not go broke you are going to regret it you are going to regret all your life decisions never go broke Be- make sure like if you have money make sure you buy it when you like have some backup like yeah you will be left with something don't be like okay whatever i'm just going to go broke anyways no 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 it's not good all right and if you were like literally saving the money for a specific thing i don't know then it is up if you were like literally uh, saving for a specific thing then it is okay but i want to buy the proof album but i cannot no yep i hate this when this camera like okay now it is not when this like like camera just changed the exposure it was too bright i just hate it when it does that and now it is not doing now it is not doing it but every time like i look this the yeah i this one this exposure change i don't like this and uh, there is like no i film for my front camera so there is no like locking option in the front view it's only in the black back one my life is full of struggles yeah so that's it for today's video i just talked about all the stuff i wanted to and be ready for some nice vlogs coming up shifting diaries that's what i have like it's going to be whole series episode 1 episode 2 episode 3 shifting series this is what i have decided and lots of things coming up stay tuned so if you want to be updated on these stuff make sure you subscribe to my channel and press the notification bell so you can get the notification whenever i upload the next video and also like this video and i will see you guys in my next video love you guys bye bye